Okay, so on today's video, I'm going to be showing you um, how to play Game Boy Advance games on your Nintendo DS or uh, DSi or 3DS. Um, for this, you're going to need an R4 card with the SD adapter. Um, so this is the website here uh, to download the emulator so it's uh, GBA Runner 2 3DS so you scroll down go to the download link download that it'll come in a zip file you're also going to need the uh, BIOS file so I'm going to leave the link in the description as well so you scroll down on this page to the Game Boy Advance slash e-reader and you download the boot ROM there you go once you have those um, just unzip them um, you're going to create a app folder on the boot of your SD card and then drag the GBA runner 2 dot NDS in here with all your emulators and then the BIOS file will go on the root of the SD card as well um, you're gonna have to rename it to uh, a BIOS.bin so that's basically it for the SD card. Now we'll get over on the uh, DS and I'll show you how to set it up. Okay, so now over on your DS system, grab your R4 card with the custom firmware and the files for the GBA. Turn it on. There you go, press A, load into your firmware, scroll over to the GBA emulator, so there you go, GBA EMU, press A. There you go, GBA Runner 2. Um, go over to your ROMs folder. So if you created a ROMs folder with your GBA games, so press A. And there's the GBA folder. Just press A. There you go, I got... Uh, uh, Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland and Mario Kart Super Circuit and Sonic Advance 3. So these are the three games that I downloaded. Um, let's start up Sonic Advance 3. Press A. There you go. Shouldn't take too long. Loads pretty quick. English. There you go, working perfectly. So this also works for the uh, DSi and the 3DS. It's the same uh, process.
So there you go. Um, I'm going to end the video here. Um, I'm going to leave all the links in the description. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And on to the next one.